Welcome to my channel. It's your girl Ashanti. Um, I want to introduce everyone to my channel. Um, like I said, my name is Ashanti. I'm a mom. I'm a therapist. Um, my channel is really going to be all about lifestyle and kind of getting to know me. And so if you're interested, please go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, okay? Go ahead and click that link for me, okay? But in today's video, we're going to go ahead and get into today's theme, which is decorating my seven-foot tree. You see it? It's bare. We got to get into it, all right? All right, y'all. So let's go ahead and get into this tree. So let me just give you a little bit of descriptions about the tree. It's a seven-foot tree. I got it last year from Walmart. Um, it was really affordable. I think it was like $39.99. Um, I wanted to go with a white theme. Um, I want to do white and gold. And so right now, as you can see, the tree is bare. It only has candy canes that were put on by my daughter. Um, but we're going to go ahead and remove those and get a little bit into the ornaments, all right? And so if I find everything, like I said, I'll go ahead and link it down below. All right, so we're going to start removing some of these candy canes. A lot going on. Not really. Just a little bit. All right. So like I said, just little candy canes that she had put on. Got them from the Dollar Tree. Just real simple and easy. Um, and then right here, <laughs> she got a little ornament. Um, we got this from Bath and Body Works. Um, and they had their sale this week where everything was um, like $3 for like hand cream, sanitizers, um, and like little mini travel um, like goodies. So we got this. Um, yeah, we just got it hanging on the tree. But now let's go ahead and get into the ornaments. Go ahead and bring those on over. All right. So yeah, I got these ornaments. Like I said, got my tree last year, last December. Um, these ornaments also got last December. I just have it packed up in this um, Walmart box. But let me get something to open that real quick. So we keep getting to it. All right, let's get into it, y'all. Yeah. Right. Let's see what we have up in here. And here, y'all. So bear with me. Not the smartest idea, just open up my box upside down, y'all. Oh. Let's go ahead and turn that to the right side up. Okay. Alright, so let me see if I can bring y'all down so y'all can see what's in the box with me, okay? So what we got right here in this box. We got some. Oh, we got the tree skirt. Tree skirt I got last year off of Amazon. If I find it, um, again, I will link it down below in the description box. But like I said, my theme is white and gold. So here we go with the gold um, Christmas tree skirt. So we go at the bottom. I might just say that for last. So I'm gonna move it to the side. All right. Um, what else we got? Oh, we just have extra little gift bags, you know, to put under the tree. Maybe, maybe not, but they're just really the wrap up gifts. Um, we got some more extra gift bags that I have from last year. Got these from the Dollar Tree last year. Um, one of our favorite stores, Dollar Tree. You can never go wrong. Get yourself some. All right, while this thing stops, and everybody and their mama is out this year. All right. Um, so let's see. Oh yeah, I forgot that I did have a little wreath. My little swap wreath. So I, originally I have one already on my front door. I forgot all about this little mini one I had bought. So cute. So I need to figure out if I want to put this one somewhere. Um, Cause yeah, the one I have on my door right now is all white and it has gold, um, gold light bulb. I can call them light bulbs, ornaments. So I have gold ornaments on them. Really cute, matching with the theme. So we might have to just save her for another time because I don't know where else in my house I want to put it. Don't know just quite yet. 
Alrighty, so now here's the best part right here. The ornaments. So yeah, these ornaments can be 50 count. Um, I believe per pack. I got two. Got them from um, Target last year. They do not have them in stock. I checked again. Um, so yeah, I have this. They're all filled with, um, let me get a little closer. They're just some regular gold ones, right? And then you have your glitter gold ornaments. Very pretty. And then um, just like a solid matte gold. Uh, yeah, so this is just my little tree topper. I think I got this Dollar Tree. Yeah, Dollar Tree. Like I said, can't go wrong with Dollar Tree. Like me and my daughter say this store. All right, but um, oh, and then I have a little black Santa in here that my mom got me last year for Christmas. Um, yeah, we might stick him on the tree even though he's like 2020. We survived 2020 and 2021, and you know, more blessings for 2020. All right, but yeah, this is what the snow, I mean, <laughs> the black Santa Claus looks like. Isn't he cute? Um, yeah, it has a little hook because he's an ornament. He goes on the tree. Put him right on up there. Yeah, and so basically I'm going to get into that. Um, I like to hang these my ornaments with these, um, the ornament hooks. And I get these from the Dollar Tree every year. They're... Um, 200 pieces and you get them for a dollar well actually this year they might be a dollar 25 because the dollar tree just went up with prices but yeah get these hook them onto the ornaments hook them onto the tree very simple so um yeah that's what we're gonna do we're gonna get into that and feel free to enjoy this video and just watch me decorate um little helper would you like to participate in the videos and help your mommy with the ornaments yeah, Mom. Okay, come on over here. Say hello. <coughs> oh, bless you. <coughs> oh, bless you. <coughs> hello. Wow, we well, don't we have some nice little ornaments? Come on over here and help Mommy. Wow. Keep them away from her, from her, so you don't want her to injure herself. Get another one for me, please. Okay, to this one. What are you doing, please? Come over here. You're not gonna help me no more? You're not gonna help me anymore? Y'all, she really, um, into lip gloss, so I think that's what she probably wearing her bathroom is on lip gloss. 
See, there she go. There it goes. Last time, show them what you got. What, what is that? Come on, bring it over here. Come here, let me see. Put some on. Ooh, girl. Is that your lip gloss? That's frozen? Okay. Put on your lip gloss, girl. I ain't mad at you. Do your lip gloss. Put that lip gloss on, girl. Wow, girl, you got that lip gloss. Okay, so here we go, right here. So as y'all can see, I'm just putting some on. Um, excuse me. We're gonna uh, just gonna be decorating. I'm putting this on for now. Separate and spread out some of the bulbs. Like I said, I have a two pack, and they're all like 50 counts all together, I believe. There's a total of, yeah, 100 obviously. Of the, uh, I, think, I keep calling them bugs, ornaments. There's 100 ornaments, y'all. So I'm trying my best to like just separate. I'm trying my best to. But it's a big tree, so we'll get into it. We'll do our best, do what we can, all right? Alright. And I know I keep jumping in out of the camera, but just grabbing some of the little hooks and putting them onto the tree. Um, like I said, keep them out of the way so my daughter really get hurt. Um, but yeah, Christmas is like one of my favorite times of the year. It's my favorite holiday outside of my birthday. My birthday's coming up as well, like three weeks after Christmas. Um, but yeah, what are some of y'all favorite traditions? Like, what are some of y'all favorite, um, like, Christmas holidays? Um, Christmas holidays. What are some of y'all favorite Christmas memories um, or traditions that y'all do for y'all selves, with y'all families, with y'all kids? Whatever the case may be, what is it for y'all? Yeah, I would like to know. Um, so far, we started a tradition, um, obviously, like, decorating the tree. But as you can see, just me <laughs> doing it right now. But, um... Really, we have gotten into like um, doing gingerbread houses. We like to do that every Christmas Eve. So be on the lookout for that video coming soon as well. Um, also like um, taking my daughter to go see Christmas lights in the neighborhood. That's always fun. Um, and also at the, um, at the like zoo or SeaWorld, I'm from Cali. Um, but yeah, they always have things going on for kids at the amusement park. So like to take her there, um, you know, sightsee and experiment and just, you know, get into the feel of the Christmas. It's also one of her favorite holidays. Um, I just love seeing her face light up every time, you know, she sees the tree decorated, but she's doing some of these traditions when she's getting her gifts. Yeah, and I love also gift giving, um, making others happy, whether that's kids, adults, whatever the case may be. So uh, that's one of my favorite things as well. Personally. Yeah, let me know what y'all like to do for, um, you know, the Christmas season. Oh, I'm gonna drop the hook, y'all. Let the hook go. Um, I got it. Um, I step on it and get injured. So yeah, we're gonna just zoot on past while I finish up the rest of this decorating and then I'll be sure to show you guys the final result, all right? Mommy, I love 
much frozen. <laughs> she wanna watch frozen now. Oh, that's another thing. We love um holiday movies. Which one of your favorite holiday movies? Comment down below. Um, as of now, uh, my favorite holiday movie. It's gonna sound weird and most of y'all may or may not know what this movie is, but um I believe it's called Christmas Cupid with Christina Milian. Uh, but anyways, um, she works as like a PR executive person and anyways, um, one of her clients ends up passing away and uh, she has like three days to um, like redeem herself and show that she's good, you know, in time for the holiday before Christmas because she's like a workaholic, she only cares about herself, things like that. So she comes face to face with that reality and um, overall it's a good movie. I like it. Like I said, it has Christina Milian. I'm gonna have Jack A from, um, what is it, Sister Sister, if y'all remember that from the 90s, if y'all 90s baby like me. Um, but overall, yeah, it's a good movie. It's called Christmas Cupid, and I love watching that every, you know, December, getting into the Christmas feels. Because it also um, puts you in that mindset of like learning to um, be grateful, um, recognizing like, you know, areas where you can improve for yourself. But, um, just overall, yeah, just making sure that you're, you know, doing right. And I like that movie, and it puts me in a nice, like, holiday spirit as well. So, yeah, let me know what y'all like to watch for um, the holiday season, y'all. All right, I'll be back, y'all, um, and y'all will see the end result of my tree when I finish, all right? All right, y'all, I almost forgot to show y'all um, these little snowflakes. Got them at Target as well this year. Um, there we go, the camera focus. Um, have about three of them. They were $3. If I could find my other one. All right, here. <laughs> right there, y'all. There's the second one. There's that one. Um, but yeah, those are all the little hidden gems on the tree. And here's the tree again in its entirety from top to bottom. And then these little pom-pom looking Christmas trees. Got them at the Dollar Tree as well. But yeah, I hope y'all like my tree. Um, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.